Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Red Bank Regional in Long Branch is being brought to you by Monmouth Medical Center in Long Branch. For the 99th time, it's Long Branch and Red Bank Regional getting together for Thanksgiving football. A great crowd in Little Silver for Thursday morning action. The Green Wave looking for a second straight Turkey Day win over their rival. RBR is without a doubt one of the most improved teams on the shore. The Bucks won the South Group 3 Regional Invitational Tournament, and here's Griffin Egan causing a fumble. Long Branch recovers. This is the start of a huge game for the junior defensive lineman for the Bucks. Final minute of the first quarter, Gunnar Eckerstrom bruises his way into the end zone from four yards out, and at the end of one, Red Bank Regional has a 7-0 lead. Opening minute of the second, Ernest Reeve fires to Shamar Williams. Looks like he's dragged down, but Williams pops right back up, and he's gone. Shamar Williams, 60 yards on a wild touchdown. Long Branch ties the game at seven. Take another look, just one hand on the turf, his knees never touch the ground, and Williams gets to the kitchen early for Thanksgiving. The big plays continue for the Green Wave in the second. Reedy airs it out. It's a bomb! Akeel Gaines is behind the secondary. 62 yards. Long Branch with two long plays, and it's 14-7 Green Wave. Final minute of the first half. RBR draws even. Pierce Olsen over the middle. Liam Stacks got it. That's a great grab. An 11-yard touchdown. Just 19 seconds to go in the second, and we're tied up at 14. On the ensuing kickoff, Saku Kamau fields it at the nine. He sees an opening and quickly ramps up. Kamau's got serious wheels. Saku Kamau beats the clock. 91 yards for the kickoff return touchdown. And the momentum swings right back to Long Branch at the half. It's a 21-14 game. Third quarter, Reavy continues to spin it. This is his third touchdown pass of the game. Shamar Williams right at you. 24 yards for his second TD. Long Branch with a 28-14 lead. Give a ton of credit to RBR. The Bucks battle back. Eckerstrom's second touchdown of the game, this time from three yards out. And at the end of three, Long Branch hanging on to a 28-21 lead. Early in the fourth, the Bucks draw even. Pierce Olsen connects with Lamar Hicks, a five-yard score. Olsen's second touchdown pass of the game, and with 9.51 to go, we're knotted up at 28. The Bucks looking for a memorable comeback win. Griffin Egan was tremendous. This is his third sack of the game to go along with a forced fumble. Keep an eye out for Griffin Egan. He's a name to watch in 2023. Third and 17 for Long Branch. Reavy is under pressure. He throws it deep downfield. Look at this catch. Michael Hall, unbelievable. 43 yards. That's the biggest play of the game. Instead of Long Branch punting it away in a tied game, all of a sudden the Green Waver knocking on the door. And Long Branch goes deep into his playbook in the final game of the year. It's a reverse to Akeel Gaines. He's got great blocking upfield and he won't be denied. 32 yards gives Long Branch the lead back. Take another look. Kamau is a feared runner. He draws a crowd. Reavy and Hall provide the blocking up the other end. And Long Branch is in front, 35 to 28. RBR had a chance to draw even late in the fourth, but this pass picked off by Shamar Williams. And that seals the deal for the Long Branch Green Wave. The 99th edition of this Thanksgiving staple gave us a great back and forth game. 35 to 28 is your final. First year coach Chad King saw his team deliver an upset in the state playoffs over Pensacken and they finished with seven wins. Shane Fallon's Bucks should be a playoff contender in 2023 as RBR jumps up from four wins to seven in 2022. We talked with Gaines and Williams closing out their high school careers with some huge plays. Um, it was a great play. I came around the edge, running back tossed me the ball, the quarterback led the way, put the corner on his butt, and I finished the job, got in the end zone. Yeah, I mean, it's good. It's my senior year, last game. I just wanted to ball with my, my guys, and I'm happy that we came out here, got the win. Now we could go home, have some dinner. <laughs> in Little Silver, I'm Rich Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.